One question people want to know is how long does blood meal last in soil? You've probably heard about blood meal is beneficial to plants. Perhaps, you're interested in using it as fertilizer. But maybe, you're a little bothered by how it's going to bear positive results. It's one thing to have the nutrients available in the soil. It's another thing how fast they get released for the plant's consumption. Fertilizers vary in terms of how long they stay in the soil. Some are slow released while others are readily available. If you're interested in blood meal, consider these factors. What is blood meal for plants? Blood meal is an organic fertilizer that's made out of dried animal blood coming from slaughterhouses. It has an NPK ratio of 12.51.50.6. It's all natural, a safe choice for sustainable gardeners. How long does blood meal last in soil? Factors to consider. Blood meal is a slow-release fertilizer that can last around two to six weeks in soil. In powder or granular form and in varying sizes, Amazon has a wide variety of options for blood meal products like Job's Organic Blood Meal Soil Amendment. To know how long does blood meal last in soil, we have to consider many factors. Decomposition process. Type of organic material. Depending on the materials used, natural fertilizers take time to decompose. Blood meal has a different decomposition length compared to compost, manure, bone meal, or vegetable scraps. They vary in their composition and complexities. Type of microbes. Once applied to the soil, the microbes present will have to feed on blood meal first. They break down complex compounds into consumable forms. This process helps the nutrients become available to the plants. The release of nutrients is dependent on the efficiency of the decomposers. The amount and nature of microbes present is a factor. Fungi, bacteria, earthworms, and other feeding organisms work together to make this happen. Type of environment. The efficacy of decomposers is also affected by its environment including temperature, moisture level, soil pH, aeration, and carbon to nitrogen ratio. Providing these ideal conditions will hasten the breaking down process. You may need to do some adjustments before applying the blood meal. Application process. Timing. Apply blood meal two weeks before planting. This technique gives enough time for the microbes to make nutrients available in time for planting. Also, blood meal has a very high nitrogen content that it can burn the plants when mismanaged. The advanced application makes the concentration tolerable. Reapply every two months to ensure a continuous supply of nutrients especially on the vegetative stage of plants. Blood meal application rate. Apply one cup per 20 square feet of soil. Excessive application is detrimental. Too much nitrogen causes dehydration because of the salts it leaves behind in the plant, burning it. Other effects include susceptibility to diseases and insects. Flowering and fruit set are also compromised. Final words. As a slow-release organic fertilizer, blood meal lasts in the soil approximately from two to six weeks. Results may take a while to show, but it surely does its job. Proper use and management lead to healthier and productive plants. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe.